We do not scare off the potential clients to the supervisory board with such a huge responsibility because this is the second element you're mentioning. This will be the responsibility, that will be the responsibility. That's not true. Isn't that true? It's true. This is the discussion I'd like maybe to have a separate one, another round table, not this one. Let's speak about that, where the sphere of responsibility begins, where it ends. I'd like to add from my behalf that the responsibility zone of the supervisory uh, board is written in the legislation and regulations, so we can debate about that. But okay, I do agree with Andrei, but there's nothing scary about that, honestly speaking. I would like to comment upon that about the Ukrainian post office, as this issue is. Well, maybe since 2015 we are discussing it between ourselves, together with the Ukrainian Post Office, or separately. It seems to me it would be a nice idea, and this is an example how different ministries having similar structures do not see the forest behind the trees. Each of them develops its own separate strategy, but two teams or three teams cannot make a deal because each of them decided they want to be the leader of the market. So Ukrainian uh, post office, when it came to the National Bank to get the bank license, it told I've got some problems because I've got a social function on me. Again, not only Oshadbe, but Ukrposhta has it too, and it's similar as far as I understand. But the banks with their cashless and technologies are taking my profits. That's why I need to become a bank. What would be nice to do to give Ukrainian post office to the Ministry of Finance just to change the owner? Then maybe we'll solve this issue quicker and more efficient way. Mr. Andrei, we have a question from the audience. I do like the interactive character of our discussion, but I'd like to involve the audience now. I saw the question over there. 